Um, quick question. In the early days, the drivers, the supply side, can you think of an example where you wanted to change their behavior, influence the way they were, like, say, used to doing something, quote, the old way, you're trying to get them to do it the new way, and you had to either, like, enforce it or maybe incentivize it? Does anything jump to mind? Well, the the star system that we had, five stars, was a very effective, people forget how how people, how much that was part of Uber's brand promise in the beginning um, and how we use that to either coach drivers to be better, to, to take them off the system, to reward them for having so many five-star trips in a row. And consumers took them seriously. Now, mostly you walk out of an Uber, you have five stars, you don't even think about it. In the beginning, people took this stuff really seriously and it was a really valuable indicator of what we could do. So let's say um, the driver, you know, um, you know, and an Uber Black didn't open the door for a customer, right? Back in the day, the customer would say that was three stars. And we try to get as much as we could, the customer would say, why? He's like, well, he didn't close the door for me. So then we would say to the driver anonymously, you'd do better if you close the door for people in your star rating. Right. And they cared about the star ratings because that entitled them to certain bonuses and, you know, certain classes of uh, achievements, so to speak. Um, so we definitely use that system with, along with money and rewards, psychic rewards, financial rewards to try to change behavior among drivers. And, and look, people complain. Oh, the, the, the car didn't smell good. It was too smelled like those those trees that are too strong and too much cologne. I mean, you name it. Riders will tell you what's happening with driver, and frankly, driver drivers learned over time to say customers were rude or they slammed the door was a big complaint. They puked in my car, you know. So you end up collecting a lot of data because of the frequency of transactions, and you you often can act on that to hopefully make both sides better.